Well, raw emotion spilled out into a Tampa courtroom as one heartbroken family member asked the judge to throw the book at convicted killer Xavier Whitehead. You remember back in November, Whitehead was convicted of murdering three people, and his sentencing was today. And he asked the judge for some leniency. Fox 13's Gloria Gomez, though, shows us what the judge decided. The day of reckoning for Xavier Whitehead has finally arrived. Recently, he was convicted of the murders of Derek Archie, Haley Stone, and Xavier Green. Every morning I wake up, my soul aches. Haley Stone's mother, Dana Stone, saying her anguish is just as raw as the day her daughter was murdered. The loss of your child is losing your soul. You don't know how to live anymore. You just learn to exist in this world. There were tears from the teenage daughter of Derek Archie. He was the only father figure that I had in my life. Like, he took care of me ever since I was a, a baby. And the mother of Xavier Green is still trying to cope with the huge void left after losing her son. Yeah, kids. How are we ever going to explain to these kids that they will never see their father again? During the trial, the jury was shown surveillance video of Whitehead walking around with a gas can after the murders. Moments later, the house went up in flames. Fire crews had a hard time getting through the front door. The reason that door doesn't open when fire rescue is trying to get in is because the deceased body of Derek Archie is right there in the front entryway. Whitehead had been defiant before the trial. Sir. Mr. Whitehead, please. And again at his sentencing. Justice is the truth, and the truth is that I'm innocent. As the judge handed down four consecutive life sentences, Dana Stone reminding Whitehead his punishment was just beginning. But I can never forgive you for taking my daughter. But I will say one day you will stand before God and you will have to answer for what you did. Gloria Gomez, Fox 13 News.